Friday, April 7th. It's Good Friday, 2023 here at Aikens and Wild Willies. Want to show you, we're getting 23s in on the regular now. This is a sold Lariat 250 Iconic Silver. Just wanted to show you, I'm loving these trucks actually. I mean, the interior and that grill is actually growing on me and I can't wait to show you what we're gonna do with some customizations to these. I know a lot of places are being first when it, with their customizations, but you know that we're gonna bring the heat and we're gonna bring the detailedness that you love and expect from us. So have no fear, we're gonna make it happen for you. And uh, the video today is about these two beauties right here, stunning trucks everywhere from the 22 to the 23 scene. So stay tuned for more on the new Super Duties. But for now, let's talk about the two diamonds right here. Chris from New York has this five to six Kelderman F450. This is the Mr. Clean, y'all. My son, I shaved my head. My son's calling me Mr. Clean. So we got the Mr. Clean F450 Reserve Edition. Looking amazing with lots of new customizations. Uh, we added to this later. We did white in the windows, white on the American Force, white on the Force and the dimples. Five to six Kelderman looking amazing with the Raptor shocks radius armed as well got some more stuff to add to it on that radius arm got light up f450 side badges we got the white lights everywhere did some more renditions up front as well tow hooks went to white and right next door of course we got my 10 inch lifted a uh, wicked lifted truck f350 single wheel limited on 42s and 26s so we go from 37s on 24s to 42s on 26s both are amazing you know i just recently got the floaters on mine in there looking incredible that's the nemesis right there we got the super single up front and just a standard setup in the back but taking those windows and the force logos to white really made a good distinctly difference and then out back again with the mr clean theme rolling that white applique throughout even doing his uh portion on top of his tailgate there on the back bumper got to put his painted lights back in that area there also but man and the next door i just went more with the stormtrooper vibe on mine all the way around so out back we got black with the white down below and uh just let me know what your style is are you more of a 450 person and are you more of a single wheel guy and then do you like the 10 inch or do you like the 5 6 inch height I mean, really, both of them are phenomenal. This truck right here is gonna give you such a great overall towing experience. We got Mag High Tech diff covers in the back. Both got MBRP exhaust too. So just different ways and different variations is you know what we love to do mile to wild scale uh, on my big boy because on 14 wise, we're on 26 by 14. And then we got uh, 15 and a half wide on the tires versus um, out back here, the Ridge Grappler, we got 37, 13 and a half, 24. So just the wheel width and the tire width makes a huge difference overall. And then of course, just 42 inches versus 37 inches. Both are star white, both have different paint schemes. So uh, just a good comparison here to show you just like mirrors and the mirrors are identical between the two. Just did black cap on mine because I have more black going on. <laughs> Look how dirty mine is, y'all. That's uh, the, the next thing, being so outward or wild on a mile to wild scale, it just slings stuff everywhere. Look at those mirrors just plastered, but they clean up really well with no issues, so have no fear there. And we actually did some paint protection film. You can see it very subtly on that mirror. The whole front hood and side pieces there, even on the rear hips also. But a Mr. Clean versus Stormtrooper. Side by side, just early morning this morning. Got a lot going on today, but just wanted to show this to you. So five to six here on 37s versus 10 on 42. Man, two distinctly different vehicles, but very same in the same sense. Now, a lot of times we like to run 38s on this application here in the five, six form, but we chose 37s here because of the super single. And it's a good thing because we still had to do a good bit of trimming to make that system work. It's just, uh, I mean, it's such a gnarly combo being that wide on 13 and a half with a 12 wide up front, just gotta do a lot. Now talking about trimming, you come over here, not too, too much on this backside, but we had to hack this whole fender basically 
back that way to get my clearance because my kit is typically used in a uh, 40 inch tire application not many times running 42s but you know real deal that's how i like to roll because i just want as big and bolsterous and gnarly as possible and we are definitely that one more shot right here i got six thousand miles in this truck now and i've been pulling a 34 foot trailer with it with no problem whatsoever been loving it got a 16 inch bulletproof drop there for your knowledge folks but uh really appreciate everyone that's checking this out and uh it just means everything and also with it being good friday that means that today is the day uh, that the crucified uh our savior jesus christ so keep that in mind uh, if, if you whether you believe or not just know that i believe in that i felt god presence in my heart i've seen him work in my life and others lives so to me that is everything that gives me the peace and the comfort and the energy that i have to go every day because i know the battle is all, already won and on sunday jesus rose from the dead and that is such a huge thing that is a part of my belief system that just keeps me going every day and just i know that one sweet day i'll be up there with him and all my loved ones y'all thanks so much for watching i forgot we got so many spare parts that come off these trucks too so uh just another great day here at akins and wild willies if you're in the market for a vehicle or anything auto or accessories also check out our new accessory retail store wywillysaccessories.com i'll catch you tomorrow peace out